Hey there, everybody. My name is Gunner. Welcome back for a new series. Well, slash new series, really. We're coming back basically to Civilization VI Gathering Storm. But the brand new DLC that came out, we're gonna play it. Uh, it's only the first part of this new D or, or deal, right? That's coming out. It's uh, they released two civilizations yesterday, the 21st. I'm playing this the 22nd. The 21st, they uh, released two new civilizations, which are the Mayan people and the Grand Colombian people. So I'm really excited to try one of them out. I think I'm going to go for Maya first off. So we're not going to waste any more time. Uh, I do want to see additional content mods. Make sure that everything's fine here. Nothing goes into uh, too much problems. I am going to disable Atlantis just to make sure that there's no problems or whatever. Pre-era uh, start gold. Yeah, sure. Extended tech tree. Immigration. All this shit. Seems like fine to me. All right. I think everything's fine, boys. I think we can uh, start that up. Now, we've I've had some problems recently with this game um, running perfectly, smoothly. So hopefully this goes, uh, this goes good. All right. Hopefully it doesn't have any problems or something like that. Hopefully everything's going to be fine. Uh, random leaders. Okay, so we're gonna choose the newly improved uh, faction. I gotta figure out where they are though Because I know for a fact right there. We got two new nations They're supposed to be downloaded So hopefully they are. Oh, there they are. Yeah, there they are. So here's one of them Lady Six Sky, which is the one we're gonna play as there we go We're gonna play as her the brand new uh, uh, people right so non capital within really a city within t six tiles of the capital uh, gain plus 10 yield blah 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 five uh, plus five content combat strength all this shit a lot of housing amenities bonuses all of this pretty great boys we're actually gonna play on I'm gonna play on chieftain let's play on chieftain boys uh play on warlord because I'm an experienced player at this point. So let's play on Warlord. A standard quick gameplay, obviously. Continents. Now I'm going to try and make it uh, to the greatest Earth map. Uh, what is this? So there, there is a new mod as well. So Apocalypse mod. This game mods add natural disasters. Larger and more impactful versions of exi existing disasters. It increases the chance of an all natural di disasters. Really? Apocalypse Moles also adds the Soothsayer unit to the game. And should uh, the climate reach its final level of change, comets pummel the earth and destroy humanity. Holy shit! It really is Apocalypse Mode. Uh, an Apocalypse Mode uh, specific to the port unit can use the cause disaster action to begin a random disaster in the exit near the, s the unit. Doing so, destroy the Soothsayer, and if it has no more charges. I kind of want to dis uh, do that. I want to try that out, just because it simply is batshit crazy. I mean, disaster? Apocalypse mode? Yo, that would be crazy. Alright, let's try that out. 86. Uh, I don't know how many civilizations I want, but I, I do want to try. I want to uh, take a look and see. Where is he? The, uh, the guy, right? I, I want to... First off, right here. Let's go here. No duplicate civilization. You can have duplicate civilization, but just not uh, leaders, basically. Uh, true start location. Civilization stat. Uh, I'll worry about that later. I want to see where's the guy that... Uh, the new guy, right? Because there's two new civilizations like that. Oh, there he is. Grand Colombia. Simon Bolivar, boys. All right. So we got that guy. So now the rest, I don't really care who's what. I'm just going to go ahead and uh, make a bunch of people. So right now we're eight. Let's put that at nine. Let's put us at 10 civilizations in total. That should be just fine at 10 civilizations. All right, boys, here we are. I equipped some mods so that I can have fast civics and fast research. So that every one turn, we're going to have something new. It's gonna really help us out. So volcano becomes active already. We are already have two volcanoes. We're starting off close to two volcanoes, which is already not good because considering the fact that we have the apocalypse mod on, 
This might, might not be good, boys. We are probably in South America, too. Uh, I am going to... I don't want to settle here, though, because that would be a big time trouble. Uh, before we settle, I'm just going to... What is this, La Venta? We already have a city-state really nearby us. Yeah, I don't want to settle here. This might be a danger, so... I'm going to continue to go here with my settler. I might settle just here. That We should be fine there, but... Uh, I don't know. If we... Um, if we settle near the volcano like this, this is too close to the volcanoes. It's going to be a problem, boys. I can't have that right now. I cannot have that. Uh, we can uh, research one of these things right here. So we're going to research pottery first, I guess. There we go. And we're going to have to skip a turn because we don't have any cities or whatnot. So we'll just skip the turn first. La Venta did decide. So world is warming. That's play. fine. Well, there we go. Sean Bede said it, boys. Okay, so we're actually, yeah, we're going to settle right here. This seems like a good place, even though we're really close to Laventa. They took our place, basically. Uh, that, that's fine. I don't care. I'm just going to be right beside them. Son, I don't care. have you seen the reign of God? It passed and entered beneath the mountains of God. There will be a ring in the sky where the water of God has passed. Yeah, there we go. So already we're right beside a natural wonder too. I don't believe in astrology. I'm a Sagittarius and we're skeptical. It is not Okay, so we got uh we got two other technologies basically we've uncovered. I'm gonna go ahead and do all of these right here. You already know how this game works basically, so I don't need to walk you guys through it. Uh we're working just fine right now. I'm gonna go ahead and sell, uh, get my warriors to stay here. That's really good. Uh, what's not good is we're two cities really close to each other. That's a city state though, so we shouldn't be too much in danger. Eventually, we're gonna probably have to invade them though. Uh, we're gonna destroy that city because I don't want to ne get near these volcanoes. But uh, that's that. We do have to look for a new research. We're gonna go as um, animal as bendery. Uh, choose a civic foreign trade just to get the trade uh, routes right. And uh, granary so. Can we... Oh, so there it is. Okay, so we need faith in order to get these guys. So apparently this is... We can, you can cause natural disasters with these guys. We got to be careful. These other nations that are strong eventually, right? They may, it might become a problem because of that. So we just need to be careful with it and not piss off anybody. Stonehenge, we could go for it, but we don't have any locations for him. Uh, I think I'm just, I guess, going to go for a slinger. There you go. We don't have anything right now. So, uh, this against barbarians. There we go. And plus ga uh, gold and faith. There we go. What about this world climate? Oh, the world climate is already at phase one, boys. We haven't even done anything. We haven't done anything. 10% loss of polar ice. This is what apocalypse mod is. Holy shit, it's getting rough already. We are, we're just starting. We haven't done anything, boys, but and it's already uh, far, uh like uh, doing that. That's crazy. If the world's no gonna dogs in heaven, it's gonna explode. All right, so we got all of this animal is bendery, all of this. We do. We are gonna need a builder, which I am gonna quickly purchase. Don't worry about that one, boys. I don't want to do anything with him. I'm just gonna send him right here. All right, so to do that, and for this unit right here, I'm gonna actually. Oh, we need a trade rat. Oh, a trader. Yeah, let's uh, quickly purchase a trader and we're also going to quickly purchase a builder. There we go. So we need a builder and all that shit. A new research. What is it? G. Oh, that's an archer. Special archer. Okay. I do need to focus on all the things I can do though. So irrigation next. And uh, I guess open borders were really good. So that's that. Government. We got uh, some new stuff. Plus two gold per trade route. Would be good, but I don't have any trade routes as of yet. I was about to come, but uh, we're not uh, going to do it anyways. Anything else? I don't think I have anything else. So we're good for the rest. So just skipping turns, boys, slowly but surely. We're getting every turn. We're getting a new uh, science thing and civic thing anyways. All right. So we got early empire and irrigation. I am going to go ahead and choose a governor for this guy. Uh, it's going to have to be him because... He's really close to Laventa. We're basically tied up to each other. I am gonna 
get send uh, the trade route to this guy, obviously. Money. Really close. There we go. We're making some money out of that. Uh, this guy, you're just gonna go ahead and build a nice be no, animal husbandry thing. There we go, boys. We're moving up big time in terms of science and all. Uh, for this guy, we're just gonna move him here. And that's pretty much it, really. Yeah, if I move him, I can't upgrade him or anything. Uh, what about the government? Government, we don't, we have some new stuff every time, but I don't need any of these things. I'm gonna go for mining next, and I guess for mysticism. Mysticism. All right, uh, Laventa, you're doing good here. Yes, you're doing uh, fantastic. All right, I don't want to declare war to them just yet. I think uh, we're gonna be fine. We don't need to do anything stupid. We're still uh, working on these, right? On these guys. Oh, uh, we can start working on one of these. So I'm gonna do that. Holy site or commercial lab, boys. Uh, I'd say commercial lab, but holy site as well. I'm gonna go for holy site. Seems like an important. Oh, I can't. I can't. Uh, there's no place for it. Uh, yeah, I don't have any building place for for uh, these. I gotta expand uh, my city then. How does it do that? Okay, it's all dark of all, all of a sudden. I don't know why it does that. Okay, there we go. It's like a kind of um, a glitch or something like that. So. Gotta continue, boys. This Got uh, mining and mis mysticism. I'm actually gonna upgrade my unit right there. And that's gonna make it so that it cannot move, right? We're not gonna move it. There's no point in doing that. I am gonna build a mine right Sometimes here. The there we go. We got the wheel because of that. Perfect. Roads have been upgraded. We're gonna get some masonry so we can get uh, working on the walls and stuff like that. Choose civic. Uh, craftsmanship and we're gonna just send some envoys to you buddy he's growing his styles are growing mines are not i don't like this there we go boys so craftsmanship masonry is done we can work on it but we already have the uh, the guy right here so we got some uh walls ancient walls already he's gonna build some medieval walls in the next turn for us as well we're gonna send our builder right here and this guy, we're just going to continue to upgrade him, all right? Instead of moving him, we're just going to upgrade him like that. Uh, choose the research. Now, next research, I'm going to go for bron bronze working. We're going to go for workforce right here. We can choose a, pound, a pound pantheon already, which is really good. Let's choose our first pantheon. Plus two face from brick tiles. Plus two amenities and housing for the seeds that they have a holy site district adjacent to a river. Uh, it's, it needs to be adjacent to a river, so not really. Plus one food and production for camps. I'm going to do that one. There we go. That one seems like a, a good one, boys. So very good. So we got all that done. I don't really have anything. We can actually build some catapults. I am going to quickly purchase a catapult. Why not? We really need to have a strong military force because Laventa is really close to us. We never know who might bronze be closer to us too. Mirror. So we got uh, workforce and bronze working as well. We're definitely going fast, right? It's going super fast. Uh, catapult, I'm actually going to go ahead and send in right there. You're going to slow down. You can't uh, build stuff. Oh yeah, because we don't have the technology yet to do that. I'm just going to uh, get uh, get him there. There we go. I actually, you know what? Uh, yeah, just uh, do that instead and upgrade yourself. So there we go. You are going to build a fish resource. And uh, you, you can't really do anything. I'm just going to send you right here. You, uh, you got to sleep. The rest, I think we're good. We do have a governor point. We're going to promote him. Do this one right here. Choose a new research. Let's go ahead and go for writing system i guess and go for political philosophy so we can get a new type of government right in the next turn actually get a, a government itself choose a production so we got to choose something else can do we have a place for a holy site we do have a place for a holy site boys uh we can go for that an encampment a commercial lab or a government plaza we could even go for the oracle but I don't know, boys. Uh, government plaza would be uh, really important, I feel like. So let's just let's just get that right here. There we go. Get a government plaza right here. 
It's really cool that we have the wonder as well right there. That's really going to help us out in the long run. We got all of this. I think, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for this turn. We're moving out fast. It's uh, level 2 population. You guys know I work usually. It's every time I've got a um, population of 5, right? For a city, I go for a new city. Writing so that's pretty much how I work. So we got Divine science rule, and political philosophy. So you are just going to go ahead and continue to uh, promote yourself. There I go. You're going to continue to heal. And uh, you can't really do anything. I'm not going to do anything with you. You, uh, we are going to go for uh, the dam. That might be good for us eventually. For disasters and stuff like that. Uh, draw my poetry. Do New government type. What do we want to go for? Uh, we want to go for classic republic. There we go. We're classic republic. I'm going to go for that because uh, I know for a fact that's, that's what probably we're, we're going to need the most. And uh, plus two influence... Uh, for envoys and stuff like that perfect boys perfect it said 42 turns but the magic man the magic of what i have see where are we at in terms of that oh i'm researching like the dam is all the way here boys okay i might be uh, just i should probably just do the archery thing though i think that's the next thing i'm gonna do is the archery thing yeah, we can build a lot of stuff now. We can build mines and all, but I, we don't really have... It's more of a fishing place, like fishing area for us, for the Maya people over here. Uh, I think we're good. We don't have anything else. The dam is done. Yes, I know. Drama and poetry, poetry is done as well. I'm just going to fortify you. I am going to promote you. There we go. I'm going to promote my catapult. There we go. And for the rest, I really don't have anything much. So we're going to go ahead and choose a new research. We're going to do archery. And uh, we're going to go for Great Library, I guess, this one. I don't have anything yet. Yeah, I think my city's... It's growing. My city's growing. Plus three amenities. Housing, not so much. We, need, we would definitely need a little bit more farms and stuff. But it's not a farming area. I mean... We're, uh, this is Mexico right here. It's me uh, normally Mexico, right? This is the region. So we need to probably go south and that's uh, just how it is really. We're kind of stuck right now as uh, where we are. We uh, still get some great points and stuff like that. Can I build a uh, purchase any for anybody interesting? I don't think I can. Civic tree, uh, not really. Great works. I, c I can have a great work somewhere. So I could probably just yeah purchase something like that a great musician maybe no i can't we're gonna found a, a religion but i am gonna need a holy site for that but uh that, that we're at least we're gonna have this guy all right so we got archery and recovered history which is really good we can actually upgrade him into an archer perfect plus four error scores just for that boys we're gonna send him right here so make him sleep we can't do anything with him just yet we're going to go ahead and promote this guy, the catapult, again. There we go. My units are going to be so strong, boys. You don't want to go at war with me, that's for sure. And uh, builder-wise, we don't have anything we can do uh, for the builders, to be honest. Really don't have anything. I'm just going to continue to... City cannot be under siege. There we go. We cannot. They, nobody can siege us, so already there's that. Uh, columns, I guess Temple of Artemis, all this, right? And uh, I guess you can go for theology. All of this, man. I mean, just take a look at our production, what we can build. We can already build all of these things. Now, obviously, we don't have anything, right? We can't really build those because we don't have space for them. We don't have enough population. And also, there's a bunch of stuff we don't have enough, right? So, eventually, it's, it's going to come to it. We'll be able to do it, but... Uh, Right now, we can't. We don't have enough product sh uh, predic sh production or anything, really, to do these kinds of uh, buildings and stuff like that. Uh, I do have a galley that I could send around the corners, but I don't have... I can't sell right now. Right? Technologies. I need to go on this direction right here in order to... I think I need shipbuilding in order to go from into oceans ocean tiles and stuff like that we got columns we got theology there we go and i'm actually yeah we're gonna fortify you now 
We got the archer here. We got, uh, yeah, we don't have anything. In one turn, a government plaza is gonna be done. And uh, the government, we got a new thing right here. Holy sight, agency bonuses. Not really. I don't care about that. I'm gonna say plus one production for all cities. There we go. That's at least gonna help out a little bit. It's only at eight production. I might uh, just go for the next thing. I know. I think I might uh, know what I, I want to go for next, right? Oh, we don't have it yet, right? And I want to do. I wanted to do an inst industrial zone, but we can't do that just yet. Well, that's fine. Military tradition for that. Send an envoy over you. You're probably mine. Yeah, he's mine now. He's basically my puppet. There is. Oh, there's an army right there, though. Uh, I could send him over. Yeah, let's let's send my actual uh, melee unit over there. We're gonna deal with these guys, and uh, I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, I can't really do anything with the builders, to be honest. There's no uh, real anything that I can do, so I would just gotta wait uh, things out, I guess. Alright, so next turn, water supply, military tradition, that's all done. I'm gonna send him right here. Uh, next stop, all these, we still can't do anything, but uh, we do have the our thing right there done, right? Our workforce or whatever. Shipbuilding, we're gonna work on that and the games and recreation. Choose a new production, so we can choose one of these. I'm thinking, which one should we choose, right? I don't know which one should we choose. Audience chamber. I'm going to go for audience chamber. It gives us amenities and housing and stuff like that. Really good stuff, right? And all right, so additional strange uh, range strike. That's going to be a formidable city right here. Really defended by tile, sea tiles and all this shit really well for uh, like fortified and stuff like that it's it's gonna be tough for anybody to really like try and attack us we still haven't encountered anybody else that's because we probably need a scout right i think um i need a scout but already too many units on this town oh is it because of the trader okay next turn i am gonna um, quickly purchase a, a scout ship building and games of recreation are done uh they're they they're, they've dealt with the um their problems with the uh i guess the barbarians laventa did so we don't need to intervene any further i'm actually yeah i think i'm good right here so choose a research just gonna do mechanics and choose a civics uh, i think alliance civil service could be better uh, could be the best option right now to go for. Next up, we I'm still looking for these housing in all cities with two city district. That could be good, but I still think the production we need production right now. So, yeah, we need to work on these things. It's gonna take 11 turns to uh, to work on these. Take a lot of turns, boys, right there. That's a uh, that's really a lot. Our expression of civil service will define. Humanity's future in the middle uh, medieval Create era, boys. Okay, so we got civil service, which means we can do alliances. But we, we don't need, we don't haven't encountered anybody else just yet. So it's not that it's uh, like it would really matter all of that. But at least we got it. So that's that. Na Celestial navigation, absolutely. We can get some arbors out of that. Choose a civic. I'm thinking just go for defensive tactics. There we go. So fun, man, to have all these different things so early on, right? Plus one amenity and two housing for governors. Uh, you're Now you're definitely intrigued me. So we're definitely going to do this one now. M uh, less production, but we got more amenities and more housing just because we got a governor on right now. Man, I'll just chamber 11 turns still. It's going to take so long. I can't build it. Okay, I can't quickly purchase a scout. So what I'm going to do, I guess, is I'm going to go ahead and do that right here. Quickly purchase all these little ties, uh, tiles right here. And uh, we're going to go for a builder next, right? Once we have the money or stuff like that. So yeah, I'm going to go for the builder. That's the next thing I'm going to quickly purchase. We got defensive tactics and celestial navigation as well. So that's really good. As always, we can upgrade our our guy again. Man, he's almost at maxed out already, boys. 
population four so we're getting there in terms of population for this city it's almost ready to have another settler and go uh settle for another city right so it's almost there uh i'm just gonna send you back here a builder now a builder cost uh, this amount of money so we need a builder boys big time right now i need to focus on all these resources choose a research mathematics and we're gonna go for feudalism okay still 10 turns for this uh the august chamber i don't have anything uh we're gonna be able to build all of these things uh afterwards like in the next turn because uh, we're gonna have population four but right now we can't build any of these which is a shame all right so we got three things done feudalism stirrups and mathematics uh, mathematics that uh, were done uh, uh, stirrups was a pop-up basically that we got for free so it gives us a courser so that's basically a knight unit or something like that we don't really need it we already have an archer a melee and a catapult which is more than enough right now to deal with anyone that would dare attack us uh, we do have machinery and also choose a civic divine right i guess we're gonna go for that and uh, yeah we're population four now which you know what that means we can work on these things now we can actually start working on these now this would give us a lot of science observatory that's normally what you want to go for for the science thingies but since i already have that i don't have to actually focus on these things anymore i can just focus on gold and production and all this great uh, other great stuff uh we are gonna wait for the audience chamber to be done and uh yeah i'm gonna wait for the audience chamber to be done and uh, after that we're gonna work on all these great stuff i do want to i really want to build her right now though really want to build her so i'm thinking what i can do well how many turns are we left here uh let me see really quick so 11 to 25 turns before the next era we're well beyond the golden age right now because of all these stuff that we've researched so i'm thinking um i can probably purchase i, I need a builder so i'm just gonna probably cheat right here a little bit builders settlers and traders are gonna be the ones i'm gonna quickly uh, i'm gonna just get right uh, purchase like that or build like that so i'm just gonna get that like that and we get a builder for free we're gonna save our money for buildings eventually that we need to build and stuff like that all right so we got that fishery crab resource i got um and tiles right we need to upgrade tiles so that's what i keep my money for uh, do we have anything interesting that we could get no not really no i think we're good so that's about it i'm gonna leave it right now boys right here we did a lot i mean in this video obviously i went really quick but uh it's already turned 16 but i gotta make it into consideration that i know what i'm doing i've got a lot of mods equipped on that really helped me boost big time obviously the research the one turn research one turn civics things is op but it makes all the things a lot more uh, fun overall and it gives us an opportunity to just be well advanced on everyone like nobody is ever going to get walls uh we're we have skirmishers which is the the upgrade for scout we're going to have that in the next turn i mean we're up there big time right now so remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the guys i'll see you guys for the next one Keep it easy.